Okie dokie, here we are playing more Mega Man Maker with my freaking stupid control <laughs> dying on me all the time. Stop! Just freaking stop! Uh, so, <laughs> today we're back with another level from Squeaks here. The. The. Um, what should we call him? What title should we give him? Uh. Squeaks the, uh, the, eh, <laughs> okay, I'm messing this up, <laughs> I, I am half tempted, I'm just, I'm just cutting this out and re redoing this, uh, let's just keep this awkward part in instead, you know, <laughs> let's just keep it in, uh, <laughs> Squeaks the Challenge Master, okay, whatever, that's your title, like it or not, 105 plays your score, <laughs> Positive 38. Okay. I am the devourer of worlds. Hmm. Devourer. Devourer. Um, I can't really pronounce that. Yeah. Mm hmm. Oh, I see. That's where we are. The devourer. <laughs> you know. <laughs> the devourer. I, I, I'm sorry. I don't know how to pronounce it. It's just... Yeah, it's really bad. And look at that, I did not know that, wait! Let's just kill that guy first. We actually have grey color. Yeah, we have the grey color on blockies now, that's really nice. Nice. So I guess... I guess we are the devourer. We're just... Consuming everything. Devourer. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm gonna have to shut up on that now and just stick with a stick with a pronunciation <laughs> and just be happy with it. Uh, nice. Couldn't quite do it without taking damage. Hmm. This room looks pretty neat, though. Psst. <laughs> shut up, guy. Doing annoying sounds. I shall consume you, and you too. Damn it! These guys have no idea what they are messing with. They are messing with Leviathan. Leviathan. Consumer of worlds. Yeah, I'm just gonna stick with consumer. That's. <laughs> I can't pronounce that much easier. <laughs> there you go. The consumer of worlds. Oh, look at this, sweet. Yeah, I really am the. Leviathan here, like, they have no chance, these poor suckers. They're just all falling prey to my supreme might. To my supreme consuming. And wow, I was a little bit nervous dying there, that would have sucked. Yeah, this is a really neat trick that you can actually use to boost the, the effectiveness, I guess you could say. Of the black hole bomb there, you know, just cancel it by, you know, switching weapons in and out. That way you can quickly rack up on damage there. Uh, well, I guess... Oh! Shoot, man. <laughs> oh, well, it's not so bad. We can just easily kill them again. <laughs> I, I should have known. I should have just gone here to begin with. Should have just, should have just felt it. Oh, no, you don't. No, you don't. Ooh. Wow. <laughs> you know, I wonder where they end up, you know, when, when you suck them into the black hole. Like, where do they go? <laughs> do they go to Dr. Light's scrapyard, perhaps? <laughs> you know, his robot scrapyard? If he has one? <laughs> That's an interesting question. Or maybe they all end up in Dustman's uh, robotic. Um, dust facility or whatever. Yeah, you know. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just making stupid conversation. <laughs> um, yeah, I really like the color colors we got going on in here too. Quite nice on the eye, on the eyes. There we go. And I don't know why I killed them. I just, I just felt like doing it. <laughs> um, oh, nice. Look at that. Could also just try doing it this way. 
Oh, he is actually immune to it. Okay, okay, okay. Well, Stone Man is just a Stone Man. I can deal with him without any issues. Oh, I guess. Yeah, we could just cheese it by doing that. But I'm, I'm sure. Um, I'm sure. Uh, <laughs> Squeaks, damn it! I forgot your name there for a second. That's <laughs> that's rude. <laughs> but yeah, I'm I'm sure Squeaks knew of that. Um, or maybe this is I did not see which de date this uh, stage was uploaded on, so maybe he did not know about that. But whatever. Not that it, it is not that it's not that it is a big cheese either way. There we go. Small froggies, yeah. Just come on over here. Join your parents in the afterlife. Wow. Nice. Sweet drops. Sweet droppings. Oh, this is... This is very reminiscent of where we were before. Maybe? Eh? I'm not so sure anymore. Maybe this is all new. Huh. I'm not sure. <laughs> I am not sure. Nope. This is definitely new. Uh, I wonder if I should have tried jumping down in any of those boss doors back there. I have no idea. Hmm. But this is kind of interesting. Um, We have these guys coming in. And so... We have to clear them out. It's probably best having the black bomb up all the way over here, you know. You know, just so that you will quickly take care of them. Or maybe... Maybe... Mm, I'm not sure, actually. Maybe they... It depends, like, how much damage the crash kick here does. It all depends. Okay, it all does no damage. But you can very easily bypass him, you know, since you gain... Invulnerability like that, but yeah, it's going to be very tricky to control it. Very tricky. Oh, yeah, yeah. Nice, nice. Oh, crap. Oh, nice. Very nice. Okay. Oh, look at that. That's right. It even... I, yeah, I remember now. I saw that earlier, but it also um, sucks up his own... Um... Yes! Oh my god! I got all quiet there. But it actually also suck up all of his own uh, ammunition or, you know, the freaking little pebbles that he launches up into the sky. It also sucked them up there. <laughs> That's nice to see. But yeah, let's use... Um, yeah, you know what, let's cut back there to those uh, boss doors there that I saw earlier. And, you know, see if I missed something. So yeah, I'll just cut back to it and I will see you in a second. Alright, so here we are. Um, I killed Stone Man. I killed Stone Man and, like, way to the... Or, no, yeah, no, actually, up, up there, like, in the previous segment, like, you see, I will just zoom in. Like, from the top screen there, when you fall down here, the room with all the totem pole guys there. Um, you, there is actually a CT code that you can potentially slide into there. So, <clears throat> I need to keep that in mind. Um, you know, now that we... Uh, or after we have killed Stone Man here. <clears throat> and if I could just stop hiccuping and clearing my throat, that would be very nice. <clears throat> Gosh darn it! There we are, okay. Oh yeah, and <laughs> I guess this is another point, like, this must be a newer stage, you know, since... Uh, you cannot have more than one boss in uh, older versions of Mega Man Maker, so yeah. My bad, I... <laughs> for some reason I forgot about that earlier, or forgot about it. I, I didn't think about it. Whatever. Just whatever. <laughs> okay, so now we fall down here again. No, we can't. Why not? 
You're... Ah! No, 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 die! Oh, yo, yo, that was close. I almost bombed it. <laughs> I almost beamed it. Okay, fall down here, maybe. Uh, yes. Yes, actually, yes. Because now, you know, we don't have the grapple from killing Bombman. However, yeah, here, we can... We can actually slide in here. There we go. Now. Oh, look at this! What is this? Uh, I am ill prepared to fight to fight this guy. Very ill prepared. <laughs> oh, he's sucking in the rain for a second there. I think he, I think I think Mega Man actually just absorbed all the rain from Toad Man, at least from the first volley. Either way, you guys are done. Get out of my sight. <laughs> Look at that. Toadman doesn't know what to do. Okay, yum. Okay, yeah. Nice. Oh my god, am I doing this flawlessly? No. Nope. <laughs> I have to open my mouth. Hmm. Okay, so I guess that's the real boss, you know, the real final boss. Okay, that's neat. Huh. Interesting. So I'm glad I saw that or, you know, went back for it. And now we can finally upload the stage. Um, there might be yet another secret <laughs> in that stage. Um, you know what? Yeah. Let's just let's just do this. Let's let's go into the editor. I am Le I am Leviathan Devourer of Worlds. Okay, so yeah, uh, I will see you in the editor in a second. Okay, so let's check this out. Uh, yeah, so on my second playthrough, I went through all of this. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I went through all of this, we, I jumped down here, and you know, I went in here, and I only had the grapple beam from Killing Bomb Man here, and so I noticed this here. So that's, here is when I cut back, you know, after getting up. Yeah, when I, when I got down here, looped around here, did all of this, came up here with the key, that's, uh, yeah, here is when I cut back, uh, and then we jumped down, back here again, C kicked up here, and down through here, and then we faced this, uh, this boss room here. So, um, I just want to check real quick. There might not be another secret. I might have been wrong there. Yeah. Okay, there was just going back down here. Because you cannot... Yeah, you can't go back there. That's just for going up. Okay, okay. So I did see everything. That's nice. Okay. So we did everything. That's pretty neat. You know, I, a rather easy stage, but a very enjoyable one. Nonetheless, you know, um, very well hidden secret as well. Like it's really easy forgetting about this one. You definitely have to do your best, you know, <laughs> try to you know tr to try and keep it in mind there. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm glad I checked through it a second time there just so that we could show it off. You know, it it definitely is very easy to to miss. Like I did notice this on my first playthrough, but you know, and I thought to myself I could get through there with. C kick, but you know, for some reason it escaped my mind. But then when I played through it again, you know, it instantly just came to me there. So, yeah, you know, nice uh, little um, what should we call it? <laughs> How should I say? Uh, the, the stage also had a, quite a few, you know, nice little scenery, c scenic rooms, I guess. <laughs> I guess I could say, like, especially, yeah. Yeah, right out here, this is a very neat and pleasant first screen, you know, to start off on. And, yeah, I really <laughs> I really like, you know, the underground um, part here as well. Like, we have some dirt here, you know, and it's very thematic and, you know, the... Yeah, it, the, the tide work itself, you know, the metal parts here <laughs> or whatever, it all just, like, it, it blends together, it blends together rather well. Huh? So it's very nice to see. Um, yeah, this this water here definitely <laughs> definitely could need some cleaning. Let's see. 
Yeah. Yeah, oh yeah, and this outside part as well. Pretty cool looking. Pretty cool looking indeed. So yeah, it definitely was a nice playthrough. Uh, I can easily see why it has gotten quite a few upvotes. You know, it was a very a very enjoyable stage. You know, it doesn't you know, it, it doesn't really it doesn't really try to challenge the player, you know, like Damn, it's so hard to express myself. It's not, yeah, you know, it's it is trying to challenge the player. If you go out of your way, you can <clears throat> do that additional boss room. That was, you know, it was decently challenging. But, you know, it's just a chill playthrough. You know, you're going around being the <laughs> the devourer of, <laughs> of uh, yeah, of the world or whatever. You're just this boss walking around, you know, killing stuff. And you know, it was nice. Well, very play, very nice, very nice and calm playthrough. So yeah. <laughs> It would be nice to see more, you know, shale things like this in the future. I, I, I actually quite enjoyed this one. This was very, very, very pleasant to play through. So, yeah. Oh, well, I will just keep it. <laughs> I will just keep it. I will just leave it at that. Uh, thank you guys for watching and have a nice day.